Mark Zuckerberg, the Facebook founder, said once, In 15 years, we'll be teaching programming just like reading and writing, and wondering why we didn't do it sooner. He wrote his first line of code at 6. Welcome to Learning Code with Python. I am Nadia Borshik. I will be your instructor for this series. This video is intended students ages 10 to 14, about grades 4 to 10. If you are students younger than that, I will introduce another series to help you in learning coding. Type your comments, concerns, and questions in the comments below to be able to provide you with answers. If you like our videos, then please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for latest updates. In this series, we will learn how to code the PyPython programming language using variables, loops, if conditions, functions, event handling, and how to draw graphics. Together, we are going to explore and learn how to write programs using set of Python commands. As an output, we will able to draw color for spiral and shapes. I will teach you how to write program to draw lines using keyboard arrows. And together, we are going to write a program that draws smiley face on click. In this lesson, you will learn about what's programming, why using Python, write some few instructions, and do some drawings. So let's start our journey. The program a set of instructions that tells computer what to do to perform a specific task or to achieve a specific objective. An example of programming languages, Java, Python, C, C Sharp, C++, and others more. Coding with some languages are really hard to learn, but with Python it's more easier and fun. Python is a generic purpose language. That means you can make all different programs with it. You can build websites, programming robots, scientific computing, and games. Uh, let's start our practical lessons uh, by installing Python application. We need only three steps to install Python by going to python.org, then download the latest version and install it. Let's do it practically. Double click the downloaded file to run and install Python. Select install now and wait until installation completes. It will take a few seconds. Here we go. Let's start our Python editor. I will type my first line of code. Print hello world. Then press enter. What if we make a mistake? Well, nothing will happen. Only a, you will get a red text and you just need to type it again. Let's try it and practice. If I type a run command like print one, the system will display an error message in red. Print one is not defined. 
To fix the error, I will retype the correct command and press enter. I recommend you to read the book called Python for Kids, a playful introduction to programming. It's a step-by-step -step visual guide to learn coding by Dr. Jason K. Briggs. Remember, code is fun and coding is a valuable job skill. See you next time. If you like our videos, then please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for latest updates.